The plot and characters in Master of the Air Episode 6 are grounded, setting it apart from other episodes. During the hour, one of the U.S. Army Air Force's officers finds himself dancing to a well-known song with a new woman. The combat drama miniseries for Apple TV Plus follows the 100th Bomb Group's activities in England during World Combat II. The sixth episode takes a step back after the heartbreaking fifth hour, in which the 100th Bomb Group suffered horrific losses on a mission. Most of the episodes showcase scenes of the characters in the skies. Welcome back to Heavy Breakdowns, everyone. In the sixth episode of Masters of the Air, Belle Pauly plays Sandra Westgate and Anthony Boyle plays Harry Crosby. The two characters meet in Oxford for an Allied Nations conference. As Crosby struggles to overcome survivors' guilt and grieves for Bubbles, who passed away in episode 5, the two become closer over the hour. In an attempt to flee their terrible circumstances, the two new friends go to a party where they hear a woman sing a well-known song. Tear the Fascists Down is the song used in Masters of the Air episode 6. In the sixth episode of Masters of the Air, Crosby and Sandra go to a party while out on a stroll and are tempted to partake in the activities. People are mingling, having fun, drinking, and playing games inside. During the celebration, Ella Walsh performs. Crosby and Sandra watch, and perhaps toast to bubbles, as Ella strums her guitar and sings the Woody Guthrie song, Tear the Fascists Down. Although Guthrie's 1944 recording of the American folk song deviates from the data presented in Master of the Air, it is ultimately inconsequential. The song, Tear the Fascists Down, from episode 6 of Masters of the Air includes a lot of subtly interpreted political overtones. In the sixth episode of Masters of the Air, who sings the folk song? In Masters of the Air episode 6, Irish singer-songwriter and actress Iden portrays Ella Walsh and performs a rendition of Woody Guthrie's, Tear the Fascists Down, the Apple TV Plus show alternates between scenes of Bucky Egan arriving at a Nazi camp, Rosie Rosenthal in the bathtub, and Crosby and Sandra slow dancing during her performance. Naturally, since it works so perfectly with the plot, the writers and producers purposely chose Woody Guthrie's, Tear the Fascists Down, for episode 6. The World War II backdrop and the words go hand in hand. The song's location also suggests that a large portion of the attendees are communists or socialists, given that American folk music was historically linked to leftist ideologies. Therefore, there are a lot of deft interpretations of Tear the Fascists Down in Masters of the Air Episode 6 that can be drawn from the song's political allusions and lyrics. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching.